Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, I will explain you the key differences between type def and macro that you have to deliver in your interviews. That will be short and precise. So let's get started. First of all, the type def is used to give data type a new name. And let's see an example. We have defined this unsigned care a custom name named byte in capital letters. And in our main block, we can use this byte keyword for depicting unsigned care such as byte b1 and b2 these b1 b2 variables will be of type unsigned care this is about type def now macro macro is a directive which is used to define alias and it is basically a duplicate name let's see an example for this one also has defined hyd for hyderabad in double quotes so wherever in our code we will write hyd in capital it will be replaced by Hyderabad in double quotes. For example, here, if we write printf and then hyd here, then it will be replaced by Hyderabad. Now let's move to some more differences. Type def has semicolon. If you paid attention in the example, you must have noticed it. But in macro, there is no semicolon. And one last key difference is type def has scope within the block or function in which it is declared, but macro replaces all the occurrences. For example, in the last example, we saw that wherever hyd will be written, it will be replaced by double quotes Hyderabad in all the code, wherever it is written, all the occurrences. Okay, so that was a quick overview about the key differences between type def and macro. If you have any doubt, you can ask me in the comment section and thank you very much for watching this video. I wish you all the very best for your job interviews.